Hi, I'm Logan Howard. I'm Aaron Payson. This happened in, in Mexico. People were saying it happened in Cuba and Texas, and I'm, I'm seeing all kinds of stuff people were saying. Definitely happened in Mexico. It happened to us. Someone else took the video and kind of shared it as their own, and it's getting millions of views. But it, it did happen to us, clearly. That's us. Lots of people have seen this video for some reason. I don't know why it's getting seen now when we were asking for help shortly after it happened and we weren't getting anywhere with it. Um, so we decided to take my car from Indiana to Mexico and drive the whole way, our personal vehicle. Um, it was a great experience. And unfortunately, we did run into the cartel and it, that wasn't yeah. great. Yeah, that this part was not great, but uh, Mexico was amazing. The people were great. Um, I would go back. I, I definitely plan. I just would not back. with our personal just vehicle. Just not with our personal vehicle, not driving across the whole country. We might go to specific areas, but my car has been stuck there um, ever since. We were having a lot of anxiety being stopped by police after this. Um, they did take pictures of our license plate, so it kind of made us a little bit weary. Mm -hmm. um, and so at that point, we were having like trouble sleeping and just anxiety all day, and we decided that it would probably be best to leave the country and mm -hmm. figure out the retrieval of the vehicle later so yeah we obviously we're here we're alive so um people asking about that but um yeah this was us we were on a back road we were looking for wildlife he's a wildlife photographer we're storm chasers um and we were just seeing what we could find because we were in an area where there was a lot of um, wetlands and stuff like that so we pulled off the highway to try to a lot of wading birds around is what they're called mm -hmm. and so I was so we intrigued to photograph some of them a lot of new birds that we've never seen in the US so we we're like oh let's go get some photos and then that's when all this happened so it's the most um, extreme experience I've ever had birding yeah for sure and, and some people are asking us why didn't you drive or and they're saying in the comments like they said no problem you could go now um I, I don't think you've ever it's people that have said that have ever had a gun in their face on a back road in the middle of nowhere eight guns at that and his body was like locking up and, on him he yeah had a after fear. seeing my life flash before my eyes like i started seizing almost like my body was i, I couldn't drive i and there was a point where i was kind of getting a little bit irritated with him no offense to him but i was just like they're letting us go. They can change their mind at any point. Mm -hmm. Like, we have to go. Looking Let's back, not I'm like, play well, around. Why didn't I go? But I, I literally, I, I couldn't. My my body, was, like, I was trying to use my legs to step on the gas, but I was like, I, I can't. Well, and they told us, too, um, to get out of there. Do not continue on this road. Turn on the next right road and get to the highway. Get back to the highway. Or, or yeah, they're leaving. They'll, you'll, which you'll I don't think that we have that in the video because they made us uh, turn off the dash cam when they realized it was recording. Um, but I don't think they realized that there was a chip inside of it that's been capturing everything that already happened. But we um, we did continue on. He was like, Aaron, go. I don't care if there's a dog in the road. I don't care if there's an animal in the road. Just go. He's like, go if there's something in the road, When we it. started getting... Um, closer to the highway, there's a lot of little speed bumps everywhere in Mexico through the towns. And oh, stuff. we were we were like <laughs> jumping over the speed limp, or speed bump, just trying to get back to the highway. Um, so yeah, we do have more uh, the front facing dash cam, so you can actually see them coming towards us. That no one has luckily gotten that video yet. We're gonna share that. We also have one that no one's ever seen that we took of us right after we drove off. Yeah, with our and cell phones, we were we, just, we just trying to document the situation. Kind of like, what just happened. And if we did end up dying, at least there's some type of video proof out 